winters in New York, yeah. And, um, you know, New York was where I landed after school, and there just were a whole bunch of us. There was a posse that came from Point. And we had that common bond, that university experience together, that made us seek each other out. And we realized that that common bond meant we had a lot more in common than not. Literally, people from Point came with me on my first jobs. My first, uh, one of my first roommates in, in New York was Kathy Kenny, who's gone on to become, you know, a wonderful television star from the Drew Carey show, you know, played Mimi. And I always think of the saying, which is, everything you want is just on the other side of fear. And I was terrified. Cindy got Kathy into, uh, into acting through improv work, through an improv class they took together, and then the rest is history. It became abundantly clear to everyone there except Kathy that she was so hilarious that she was destined for great things in the comedy world. I directed Kathy's improv show. Um, Kathy and Cindy were part of that five-person uh, uh, improv group called Bell Jest. I'm from Stevens Point, Wisconsin. I was born and raised here, and I always say you can take the girl out of Wisconsin, but you can't take Wisconsin out of the girl. But I, you know, would never have thought that, you know, I'd also be somebody who got to win an Oscar. So it's very funny, you know, where life leads you. And I knew somehow that New York had my name on it, as did Kathy, as did Cindy, and we were all really served quite well by it. If I could go back and tell any college student anything, I would say to them, look around at the people who you really love right now and don't let that go. Because 10, 30, 50 years from now, those are the most important people in your life. They really are.